good. How you doing? Of the 30,000 new troops headed for Afghanistan, how you doing? Let's see. This one is the most special. Good to see you. You're all grown up. At least to me, he is. I've known 21-year-old Marine Lance Corporal Heinrich Solto since he was third grader. Heinrich Solto. Is your mom home? No. That's him. Heinrich was my little brother in the Big Brothers program. He grew up in L.A. with his mom, an older sister, and a younger sister, which meant I was the only male figure in his life, the only one he had to talk to about intellectual, guy-type stuff. Well, I don't remember how it feels like vomiting, and I don't think I would like vomiting anymore. No. Does anybody like it? Um, very few people like vomiting. Heinrich and I got together once a week, every week, for 10 years. I've seen a lot of changes in him, but nothing as dramatic or as positive as what I see now. This story is about how the Marines changed him. Just, I had no discipline whatsoever. And how by changing him, the Marines changed me. Well, I'm not successful by any means, but. <laughs> no, you are successful by a lot of means, and I guess that's what I'm realizing. Before joining the few and the proud, Heinrich belonged to the bored and the uninspired. In high school, he was a five-star underachiever. And in college, Terrible. his grades were so bad, he still won't tell me what they were. All I know is he dropped out. And yet, his staff sergeant here at Camp Pendleton says he's a model Marine. What did you do? <laughs> you teach them all to work as a team. You put them in stressful situations in training. And he'll come back more mature and... and uh... Even more mature? Oh, he will. I don't know if I'd recognize him. <laughs> I never really knew the value of a hard day's work <laughs> until I joined the Marine Corps. The fact is... I think it's all about wanting to be there. Heinrich never wanted to be in college. That was more my dream than his. Did you feel pressure to go? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I think at the time I thought everybody should go to college. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't think college has to be the way for everybody. No, I realize that now. Ironically, we're still at odds on the issue. I mean, I know eventually I'm going to have to get out of the military. We've just switched so, sides. Well, not necessarily. Now he thinks he may want to go back to college, and I think he's doing great here. Regardless, it's a decision for another day. Let's go, Soto! Yes! Last month, he and the rest of his company shipped out for Afghanistan which is my new beef with the military. Here they hand you this whole new person to appreciate. Yeah. See you later. Then all too often. Be safe. Love you. Thank you. Ship them right back out again. Heinrich's company is on a security duty in Afghanistan, and if all goes well, they'll be back home in 82 days. But who's counting? I think you are. <laughs> what a nice friendship. Yeah, Thanks for sharing that with us. That was really sweet. Thank you.